What's going on guys this is me Mehdi Shakil and you are watching SS Tech Tutorial. In my previous video I already show you that how you can get this Unix workstation or Unix gateway in a virtual machine on your Ubuntu computer. And in this video I am gonna show you how you can anonymize your Kylinux machine or all of your Kylinux traffic using the Unix default gateway. And in this video we are not going to use the Unix workstation. We are only gonna use the Unix gateway and the Kylinux as our workstation. So further ado let's get started. But before that, if you need to this channel, then please do subscribe this YouTube channel. And if you have already subscribed, then thank you so much. Okay, guys. Now here I am in my Ubuntu computer. And now if I open my virtual box, and here you can see in my previous video, I imported these two virtual machine, the Unix gateway and the Unix workstation. Now for anonymizing Kylinux operating system, we don't need this Unix workstation anymore. So we are going to remove this one. Okay. Now we have the Unix default gateway and the Kylinux operating system. So now let me show you how you can anonymize your Kylinux operating system using the Unix default gateway. So first of all, select the Unix default gateway in your virtual machine, then start it. So here you can see we have successfully started the Unix default gateway. Now what you need to do, you need to open up this terminal here. Then here you need to type slash sbin slash if config. Then press enter and you will get the IP address of this Unix default gateway. In this Unix default gateway, you will get two interface. Ethernet 0 and Ethernet 1. You have to take note of the Ethernet 1 IP address, which is 10.152.152.10, and the subnet mask is 255.255.192.0. Now, again, go to your virtual machine, then select the Kylinux operating system, then go to settings, then click on network. Now, here in the network tab, you have to make sure you attach to the internal network, and from this drop down menu, you have to select the Unix, okay? Then click on OK. Now after that, power up your Kylinux virtual machine. Now our Kylinux machine has successfully started. Now let me keep this virtual machine side by side. So this is our Unix default gateway and this is our Kylinux operating system. I am going to use this Kylinux operating system as a workstation and I am going to send all of this Kylinux traffic through the Tor network using the Unix default gateway. Now if you look carefully on the network connection, Kylinux is not able to connect with the network. Now what you need to do, you have to assign an IP address on your Kylinux machine so that your Kylinux machine can use the Unix default gateway as the default gateway of your Kylinux operating system and can send all the traffic to the default gateway. Now what you need to do, you have to select the Ethernet connection, then click on this setting icon and it will open up a new tab where you can assign an IP address for your Kylinux operating system. Now go to IPv4 setting, now click here and set it to manual. Then click on this add button. And now here you need to set a new IP address according to this IP address. So in our Unix gateway, the IP address is 10.152.152.10. And here you need to type 10.152.152.11. 10 10.152.152.11. Then for the subnet mask, you have to put this subnet mask 255.255.192.0. So here I'm going to type 255.255.192.0. And as the default gateway, you need to type this IP address, the IP address of the Unix default gateway. So here I'm going to type 10.152.152.10, the IP address of this Unix default gateway. Also copy this IP address from here and also put this IP address on the DNS server. Then click on save. And now here you can see our Kylinux is successfully get connection with this Unix default gateway. And now let's check does our Kylinux operating system using the Unix as the default gateway and sending all the traffic through the Tor network or not. So I'm gonna fully screen my Kylinux computer, okay? Now you have to open up your browser and here you need to type check.torproject.org. And guys, now here you can see our browsing is using the Tor connection. So that means our Kylinux operating system now has been successfully configured to use the Unix as a default gateway. And now all of the traffic of this Kylinux operating system are going to route using the Tor network. So guys, that's all for today. I hope you like this video. If you really like this video and enjoy this video, then please give it a big thumbs up and share this video to your friends. And guys, if you're new to this channel, then please do subscribe to this YouTube channel and don't forget to press the bell icon to get all the latest upcoming video tutorial notifications. I'm Mehdi Shaki. You are watching this tutorial and I'm signing off.